Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three new to us candy bars. These are all from Finland. They were sent to us from Elena and Ilka. I'm probably pronouncing that completely wrong. I'm sorry for butchering your names. Uh, know that we really appreciate you sending us these. Uh, this, um, the company name is pronounced Fatser. That is yeah, how really? you pronounce it in Finland. Um, this is Carl Fatser, and I have the milk chocolate bar, and this one is milk chocolate with hazelnut, and then Kevin has a mint with milk chocolate. If you say so. so <laughs> I say so. Okay. It's ISO Star Packs. <laughs> Let me tell you a little bit about the, the company. Uh, it's, I see, we would have said Phaser. Mm -hmm. But it's pronounced Fatser. It's one of the largest corporations in the Finnish food industry. It was founded by Carl Fasser in 1891. They have a chain of restaurants, bakeries, candy shops, and cafes, which mm -hmm. I think is really cool. It's pretty good. Um, the the sure. classic blue milk chocolate is famous in Finland, and the color of its wrapper has been used by uh, Fatser as a symbol for the whole product line. In November 2016, they opened a 54,000 square foot visitor center that circles a botanical garden and it has a cafe and shop. So, so if similar you, to like Hershey, Pennsylvania or something. Yeah, if you go to their website, it's a really cool building. It's huge and you can actually go there and you can see candy being made. Um, it, it's the confectionery. It's where the confectionery part is located. So it sounds really cool. Mm, that's not cool. Um, so, so Hershey's does the same thing. And right, the exactly. Is, so. And they that's even cool. have like a park, a Hershey park, yeah. an amusement park. Uh, but this is the one that they're famous for. This is the milk chocolate bar. This is the one that when Elena and Ilka um, uh, sent this to us, they said that this one was their favorite bar. So we'll try it first and move on from there. Okay. And it has Fatser written on it. It is in uh, five sections. And I'm Pretty just gonna. Thick. You want me to bite this in two? Uh, sure. Or whatever. You can go ahead. Hmm. That's a good chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's just a very good milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think, it's not super sweet, but no. it's also, it does have sweetness to it though. Right, but it's not as sweet as, I don't think it's as sweet as Milka. No, 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 Milka's much sweeter. Yeah. Um, but it's more sweet than some European chocolates that we've had. Right. But that is a really nice milk mm. chocolate. And it's good. It's, it's very, very, um, I don't want to say it's hard. It's, um, it's got a snap to it. Yeah, it does have a snap to it, even though it's milk chocolate. It is kind of hard. I think it would take you a while to eat that because you're you're having to bite into it and chew it. Didn't take me long. <laughs> well, that was good. Okay. You got strong teeth. This is the Geisha. It is milk chocolate with soft hazelnut filling. So I can't wait to try this. One. I'm interested to see how strong their hazelnut is. Yes. Because like Germany, like really loves their hazelnut. That's nice. That's very nice. That's actually just right, the amount of hazelnut. Mmm. I'd go half of that. <laughs> I did too. It has a little bit of a, it's not crunchy, but it's, there's a definitely a different there's a texture, texture in there. Yeah. It's, it's oh. like it's whipped, but there's something else in there yeah. too. It's like it's got, it's not powdered hazelnut, but it's just like a little bit more than powder. Right. So you get that little feel of, of a texture in there, but, mm -hmm. but you don't feel the crunch. Like so little weird. pieces. Mm -hmm. that, I mean, I just got a little piece even in between my teeth. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. So it's like a little piece of hay. It's really good. That is delicious. I like that one more than the milk chocolate. I do too. It's, but we really like hazelnut. <laughs> well, yeah, we, we um, enjoy it quite a It's bad. the perfect blend of chocolate and hazelnut. Mm -hmm. It's really, really good. Especially if you like hazelnut, I think you would like that. Yes. One. And it's a good sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that, that's, that's very, that, yeah, that one is much sweeter than the first one, I think. This is a mint. It is a mint truffle. Uh, it says 78% uh, 
uh, dark. Milk chocolate. Oh, milk. The writing is so small, I can't. It says 78%. I don't know what that was referring to. But yeah, this, oh, and it looks different. This one, instead of having like six, five different like segments, this, no, uh, this it's is one, it's one stick. big bar. It's like a stick. I can smell the mint coming off of that. Hmm. I like that texture. It's mm -hmm. kind of. It's oh, very soft. Wow. It's almost chewy. Mm hmm. Yeah, that doesn't feel like a mm, I wasn't expecting that at all. typical candy bar in your mouth. Mm -hmm. It is, it, it's chewy, but it's not like, it's not like caramel or taffy no. or it's anything It's almost like, that. like it's got chocolate with marshmallow cream or something, like a marshmallow kind of feel. Yeah, to it. that is exactly what it is. Not feels quite like. as tough as that, but right. it's, it's, that, it's like that. Right, that is a, that's actually really good. very good. And I love the mint in it, the mint. Mm, it goes really good to go. It's not, it's not too harsh. It's not like toothpaste or, mm. uh, which no, I not. like toothpaste, but I mean, it's <laughs> Don't not, want to eat it in a candy bar. It's not like toothpaste. Um, that is a very nice mint. Mm -hmm. My favorite's the hazelnut. Mine is too, the geisha. I yeah, love I really, the geisha. really like that one. And then I probably like the mint next. And then the milk chocolate. The mint's not something I would want to eat all the time. It's not for me either. I would, if, if I'm going to eat something regularly, I'd probably rather have just the regular milk chocolate. But, right. but this would definitely be something if I was in the mood for mint, I would go for that in a heartbeat. If I only could have one though, I would I'd have pick the, the geisha. Yeah, yeah I agree. the hazelnut, because that is just so good. I agree. So um, I will take a picture of these. Uh, the geisha, you, uh, well, I'll bite into it and then you'll be able to tell the difference. Um, so uh, thank you so much for sending these to us. We really appreciate it. It's awesome getting to try mm -hmm. something from Finland because we never have before, have no, we? Well, we might have. I don't think Not, so. I don't think anybody's ever sent us anything from No one, them. yeah, no, definitely. I mean, if we picked something up, it was up by accident. I think we've gotten things from Sweden. Like the licorice and stuff. I'm pretty right. sure we've gotten stuff from Sweden before. But, but not, not Finland, Finland, no. So so I hope you all enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed getting to hear a little bit about the company. And thanks for watching.